Ahead of the forthcoming elections, the People's Democratic Party's presidential candidate, Atiku Abubakar, has arrived at the state for a town hall meeting. The meeting, attended by party leaders and stakeholders from 72 groups, were present. Responding to questions from the audience, Atiku promised to address unemployment and insecurity, hence provide a living standard for the masses and uninterrupted free education for students. Workers, the working force, they are the victim of any misadministration or maladministration. And so, we are here to hear from you. What do you have to address growing unemployment in the country? We are here also to know what you have for us to better the living standard of the masses of this country. We will make sure there are no more uh, actual strikes in our universities. And how do we make sure that there are no ASU strikes in our universities? We will budget more money as far as the education sector is concerned so that we will be able to pay our teachers and we'll also be able to look after our universities and upgrade them and provide the necessary facilities as far as our educational institutions are concerned. I know very well about university education because I have been running a university in the past 20-something years, and we have never gone on strike for one day. Also speaking at the campaign held at the Alake Palace of the state, the PDP governorship candidate Oladi Pupo Adibutu vowed to prioritize local government autonomy in the state if elected. Since the last administration of PDP in this state where we lost autonomy, of the, of the local governments, we have had no progress at all. I guarantee you, by the grace of God, we shall return the local governments to the hands of the people, and by the grace of God, that shall be progress for all. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.